Yo, 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 yo. Let me make sure. See, Virginia skill tree should be fixed now. Look like it is fixed. I just, I'm going down a certain path. I bought Anna too. Hold on, where they got Anna? Are we waiting on family members? Really? Leland was talking all that, all that smack and then left the other Leland. Or maybe it was the same Leland that came right back in.
discovered abandoned, with officials reporting no signs of foul play. Authorities are hopeful that the expanded search nearby I'm guessing it was the same Leland. Here come Leatherface. And woke up Grandpa. God damn. It's quite obvious they don't care by waking him up. They don't care. But Virginia's skill tree is fixed. Is she over here? I can get through here, I think. Which way did he go? Oh, hell. No. They unlocked this door, of course. I don't understand why 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 not unlock a whole bunch the all the other doors and not just just the one. Are, are you okay? They got somebody. Damn, they got Connie. Everywhere I turn, there they are. I'm gonna try to unlock. No, no, no. Let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do. Oh my God. Come on, go, bro. I'm going to try to go behind him and unlock it.
That's why you gotta play stealthy. Can't be too all out in the open like that. Here she come now. Shut up, Virginia. Goddamn. He got killed. Oh, fuck. Come on, hurry up. GG, hurry up, hurry up. Hurry up, hurry up. I'm out, GG's, GG's. That's what happens when you play stuffy. You gotta play stuffy. You can't be all out in the open like that. <laughs> they all got killed and then disconnected. Why is the thing not going down? What the hell? Did the game freeze? I think the game froze. What the hell? Oh, never mind. It's working. I thought it froze on me. Seemed like it froze. Up, oh, yep, something did happen. It's crashing. It booted me out. Like, really? Wow. Hold on, let me do this. After these updates, some it always be doing this extra stuff. I'm make sure I load into another game and then go back. All right, I'll go back to home. Yeah, I knew it was from the crash because it just froze on me. I hope this thing break her, uh, her... This update didn't break the whole damn game. Well, yeah, it looked like her skill tree is fixed on this side. 
Cause you wasn't even, you didn't even see no pictures over here. I figured it was going to crash because it froze up on me. What a surprise. But it's not surprising. I sure hope they do something about this lobby dodge and stuff. They need to add penalties for this. For real. That needs to be in the next update. That like a big update, they need to add lobby penalty. Because it's too many family members that quit because they don't get that way. The victims be quitting too. Don't get me wrong. But it's way too many family members just quitting in the middle of the game. Like, it's really annoying when they do that. For real. It's like a lot of people just don't want to play family because of stuff like that. More people were playing victims anyway. But it's really bad when you got people that... In the middle of the game, they'll just quit. They'll get mad because you ran to the same place at the same time as them and they quit. Or they be like, oh, well, one person got out, they'll quit. And it's like, what did you even play the game for if that's your attitude? You're going to quit every time somebody quit, uh, gets out? Like, why even play? Stuff like that needs to be penalized. And I, I, I understand they can't control what everybody does, but they need to have a lobby penalty on... When people quit in the lobbies because they don't like the map or whatever reason, I mean, I get like you, you might have to leave or go somewhere. You got to turn your game off. Okay, I get that emergency situation, whatever. But it's so it's many people out here that's just quitting for no reason. They just quitting because they don't like the map or they quitting because they didn't get the character they wanted. They quitting because whatever other reason that's outside of an emergency or they just want to get off the game. Like, I had two family members quit yesterday. One dude quit. Now, mind you, he didn't talk on the mic the whole time until he was getting ready to quit. He said, why are you running at the same spot? He wasn't talking to me. He was talking to the other family member. And then he just quit. Why y'all running in the same spot? And then he literally just rage quit. Like, what was the point of even playing? Then I had a cook the next game at the family house. They said, like, oh, you got to find the, uh, it was a, a Sonny left. He was the last one left. And then it was like, oh, you got to find him. And then he quit. So they need to in introduce a lobby, uh, lobby penalty for that. Like that, that's getting old for real. That got old real quick. That got old super quick. Now this is taking almost down to 10 seconds, I'm sure, to find a victim match. That, Like I said, that got old super quick. For real. $60 local promo credit for new customers with one new line with your own 4G or 5G phone on unlimited welcome playing required. Bro, what the fudge are they playing? In times of congestion, unlimited 5G and 4G LTE may be temporarily slower than other traffic. Domestic data roaming at 2G speeds. $10 a month for each my plan per. Additional terms and conditions apply per per. 
The Honda you want is here. What are they in the background listening on a is what the hell? They got a whole radio show playing. A whole radio show playing. In the background while they playing the game with their mic on. Oh shit, I got new cosmetics. Uh which one do I wanna do? I'll change to this one. Nah, I wanna do red. The cosmetics are working, so yeah, it worked. But the update was, it crashed my game, but it was crashing yesterday too. It crashed once, I think. Ah, uh, of course the family member love. See, this is the shit that I'm talking about. Stuff like this, they need to put a lobby lobby penalty on. I hope they do that because they're going to have to do something to mitigate this. Can they fully stop it? No, they can't fully stop it. They could try to mitigate it. I've said it multiple times. Because when you got family members quitting just for no apparent reason, they used to quit because the slaughterhouse. Then they changed the spawn stuff with the with the valve handle. They changed that where it spawns at. And people are still quitting. Then the mill, everybody wanted to play on the mill, so they was lobby dodging to get to the mill. Now the family members don't barely want to play on the mill. Like, they'll just quit for no apparent reason. But it's like, what can you do? You can introduce a lobby penalty and, and hopefully that'll mitigate it. A lot of people said, well, hide the map, but hiding the map is not going to do anything because as soon as they see the map, they're going to quit as soon as the map start. That's not going to keep them. That's going to keep them until once the cutscene is over, even before the cutscene is over on the map, they're, they're going to wind up leaving. This lobby backfield is really bad too. They need to fix that. That and the lobby, the lobby dodging, which they need to do a lobby penalty and then fix this backfield. Once they fix that, they, they, it should be much better because I don't get wh why they can't fix that, why they haven't fixed it up to this point. Actually, I think they did fix it, but it's a bug or something again, supposedly. Supposedly. That's what they say. It's just like we just sitting here. Sitting here in the lobby simulator. But she do got new cosmetics, so. A lot of people wanted that. Virginia used 10 times. Virginia used five times. I think I used her five times, didn't I? Or maybe it's five times from this point. Because these wasn't unlocked at all either. See, now we're just sitting there, man. They, they got to do something about that lobby, that lobby backfield as well. They have to. And if one of the victims don't leave, it's not going to reset. Most of the victims will just sit here until they'll just sit here until the the, the timer goes down because they don't want to leave. They don't want to go back to waiting damn near five minutes to get into a match. That Sunny build is cool though. He got his, he got jump start on. That's smart. Anna and Connie need to have jump start on too. They run out of stamina way too fast. Even if you put their stamina all the way up to forty or even fifty, they still run out of stamina way too fast. I don't think Virginia got jump start. Do she?
Nah, uh, she got condition. Yeah, no jump start for her. But when this goes up, 37, that's going to be 44. Once this gets to level three. You mean to tell me out of all the family players, only one person came in? It seems like the victims are more patient. They'll just sit and wait. Sometimes I be I be hoping that one of them leave. Sometimes it happens they'll they'll leave, but a lot of times they won't. They'll just sit there. I do her skill tree. Like go another route. See, this is all the way over here. I need to what I need to get this up to level three because I don't want to re redo her skill tree and then I gotta do that what doesn't kill you all over again. Somebody get impatient and leave. Somebody get impatient and leave. They're not gonna leave. Fuck. Uh, a lot of the victim players are not gonna leave. They're just gonna sit there. The funny thing is, we'll have three family members in the lobby, and then they will, they'll all quit at the same time. Or run, one right after the other, maybe a couple seconds later, and it'll be like, damn, it was a full lobby. Whatever they had going on before they did the Virginia update, it was filling up much faster. And I literally, when I was going to quick match, I was getting more victim matches than family matches. So I was like, it's filling up quick, it's filling up better. Whatever they did, they need to do that again. And introduce the lobby, the lobby penalties. Once they do both of those things, with the backfields and the lobby penalties, they should be fine. They should be good. I mean, I don't understand like, They don't really need to do anything else after that. Obviously the new family member, but people are, people keep sitting in lobbies, keep sitting trying to find, especially on the victim side. On the family side, you can find a match really quick.
It's just a lot of people, they want to play victims. They don't want to play family. Then it's like, well, you can't play victim all the time. I mean, you can if you want to. But you, this is what you're going to have to deal with. You better off playing family some, at least some of the time. I know later on at night, it's a little better too. Cause I play some matches. I play matches at night and it's much better with, on the victim side. Cause there's not as many people on. That could be one simple way to do it too. Play matches at night, you get on the victim side faster. God damn it. And they got Honor too. And Sonny. The people I need to fucking love. Oh no, they ain't got Leland no. I'll get Leland. Are you still waiting on the family member, bro? Like, what the hell? Damn, I only got this to level one. This is level two, level one. Man, I'm not finna sit here the whole time and, and Jesus fucking Christ. I bet you they had three family members and one of them fucking left. That lobby had to be filled up. They didn't feel... That was not... Well, maybe it wasn't, but... I'm assuming that it was filled up. And I'm with them. I'm with gun on a lot of stuff, but when they say they, they don't believe in lobby penalties, they, they gonna have to let that shit go. Cause that them not believing in lobby penalties is this is what's happening. A lot of people keep quitting like this. This is what's gonna keep happening. And then the back feeling is really bad. It's just bad. It's been bad pretty much the majority of this game. They had it one right before that Virginia update. They tweaked it, and I was I, like I say, we everybody was getting the matches faster. But now it's like whatever happened with the code after that update is it's still messed up.
Whatever happened in the code with that? So. Oh, I bet those two definitely aren't hacking. It's still messed up. Well, hello again, Edge. Yo. How you doing, buddy? Ah, shit. They working together as a team. They know each other. Wish group. Right, at this point, we should become best friends, man. Uh, no, I just me. All right, no, it's fine. It's fine. Wish group. Really it, it's all good. They know each other. We screwed. New details have emerged in the grisly string of murders that littered Interstate 40 during 1971 and 72. Known only as the terror of I-40, authorities say an unidentified woman spent years hitchhiking from Texas to California, where she viciously murdered several truck drivers and three other young women along the route. Billy Jasper of Winslow, Arizona, claims he likely had an encounter with the assailant at his home over a year ago. Jasper says a young woman in her 20s approached his home seeking water and food, but after a few minutes, the woman allegedly... What the hell? Damn, it froze on me. Oh, we good. He's been freezing up a lot. That's like the third time that did that after this update. I have no clue why it's doing that. Well, I mean, obviously the update, but what the hell? I'm leaving all that stuff in too. Cause that way people see that this shit is crashing like this. I wonder if everybody's getting crashed on that lobby. I mean, on that, that match. I got to do this all over again. Hopefully it doesn't crash again. We shall see though. We shall see. It's like every time they release an update, some of those breaks. 
Then they gotta release a patch to fix that. To get it straightened out. Good thing though, know, I didn't have to end my whole stream and start over. And it took all that time to get into a game and then the fucking thing locked up again. Ooh, they got a black dress. I like that black dress on her. I don't want to use like lighter colors because then they see you much better. Oh, they got condition on they they uh Virginia, which is that's good. That Connie got jump start. Ah. See, that's what I would like. Like, when the when the family members are all gone, they should the one of the victims should leave. I mean, I was one that one victim that left, but it'd be nice if other victims just leave. That way, and see that backfill is super quick. Oh my god. I don't understand why that leather face just left. Look, there go another family member. Now we're just sitting here once again. There's the third one.
Not finna sit here this whole time. Like, this is ridiculous. It's terrible, man. On the victim side, it's bad. It's bad. Like, that's really bad. For real. They need to put lobby lobby penalties on, like, ASAP, man. They don't need to wait. They need to be working on an a update right now within the next couple weeks to, to, I would say, within the next two, two three weeks to, once, they, once the people know that they're going to get a penalty, they'll stop doing this shit. They'll stop as much as they can, I guess. They're going to still do it, and they probably not going to care about the penalty. But after, like, a certain number of times, you get a lobby ban. Like, you're, you're leaving for no apparent reason. It's ridiculous. It's really ridiculous. You got a full lobby, and then the family members just fucking leave. Like, why are you leaving? I would love to get a survey and ask all these family uh, mains why they leave like that. They're probably not going to answer, get a, a truthful answer. I just want to know what they would say, though. But I doubt if they'll give a truthful answer. They'll probably get some bullshit answer like, uh, uh, I got to go use the bathroom or some bullshit. But the ones, if you notice the people that's constantly doing that shit over and over, they should take a survey, like, of all the players of their game. I don't know if they got, I don't know if they have this information, like, if they got access to this information, like, how many people quit actual lobbies. It'd be nice to have that information, though, because they'll know, like, how many people are quitting and the ones that's constantly doing it over and over and over again. Because that shit gets old, for real. It gets really old. I say they done change stuff around on the slaughterhouse. The family house, They a lot of family members, they don't, they don't lobby dodge that. But the slaughterhouse, they change stuff around. People still... Be in a lobby and then they'll see the slaughterhouse and they'll leave. Now with the mill, they're doing the same exact thing. It's like it's a joke. You gonna play on the map that you wanna you like you don't wanna challenge yourself to to actually win. You just wanna have an easy win all the time. Well, good luck with that. Good luck. See, now we got three family members. Actually, you know what? I'm going to get Sonny. We literally got literally three family members. All right, they done switched off, I guess. Oh, they actually fucking stayed. assault and larceny and was sentenced to five years in prison. After his release, Omar Pauly was implicated in a street of outside the Clinton County, where he was arrested again but managed to escape authorities. His current whereabouts are unknown. The remains of an unidentified male have been discovered near Devil's River off my This makes people not even want to play. At least not on the victim side anyway. I much rather play family, but at some point I want to play victim too. I have to find the other that can use this. 
Oh shit, I did not mean to do that. But he about to wake him up anyway. Of course, it's a fucking PC player. Let me latch that so they can't get back in. Move out the way, man. Or lady. This will help. Hey, I can use this. I can get you here. She going out this way? Why did you just close the door? Ready. He's sitting right there. Now I just gotta find a few. They all on them. I gotta go downstairs. The fuse box is open. Oh shit, I'm going the wrong way. The fuse box is open, which is a good thing. This is not open. Well, of course, Connie's dead. That's what happens when you play like that. That's exactly what happens when you play like that, trying to play aggressive with Connie. You're not supposed to do that. You're not supposed to do that with Connie, but they all know they all know what to do. They know everything. They're waiting to turn that off.
Ci. So you got it, bro. Damn these freaks. God damn, bro. Damn, him. what the fuck? Oh, shit. And she, I'm dead. They seen me over there because I fucking moved. God damn. I moved like an idiot. I was like, oh shit, I'm moving. Like, no, don't do that. Ah, oh well. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. They, op they open that basement as a quick fashion in a hurry. I was going to try to reopen it, but didn't work out because I moved too quick. But let's go back to the Connie. She got killed super fast. That shouldn't have happened. She got killed way too quick. But that's what happens when you play aggressive like that. And you shouldn't play aggressive like that with Connie. Connie is supposed to be protected at all costs. Connie, Danny, Virginia. They're supposed to be protected at all costs. They're not supposed to be played with aggressively like that. But like the one dude told me, I'm a level 99, so I know what I'm doing. But then he got killed and I was the last one alive. Him and the other guy, both level 99s. They knew what they were doing, but they both got killed early on in the match. Yep, they knew what they were doing. Thumbs up to them.
I don't know how anybody could play victim side the whole time. It's brutal, like I say. It's really brutal. I don't know how they can play victim side the whole time. They better than me, cause I would I would have to switch to family like at some point. They much better than me. I would have to switch to family at some point. That's why I don't just set myself on just one side. That Connie got a jump start, which is good. Now we wait on these two to ready up, like. Oh, they switched to the cook. That's even worse. Now nah, he ain't gonna be able to catch nobody. We got a Connie, a Virginia, and a freaking Danny. Danny can temper the valve now. He can definitely, they, they release it in the update. He can, he's back to being able to temper the valve. Are we at the slaughterhouse? Yeah, we are. Oh, she's grabbing that. Well, they're making a whole bunch of noise over there, so... Might as well unlock this door over here, Connie. This was the door I was gonna unlock anyway. I need to get that powder stuff. I don't know what any of it is. I think it's some over here. Is it powder over here? I don't even know. Oh my God, where's the powder? It must be upstairs. Oh no, there it is. That's open already. At least I got something to protect myself. I wonder if she went. Fuck. Yeah, 
Yeah, she needs to pop that lock off of the. He coming this way. It's in your eyes. Ah, oh, he went that way. Damn. Oh God, Jesse, please, damn. Not again. Oh my God, bro. How the fuck did the cook catch up to me that fast? What the fuck? That's crazy how he caught me that fast. I guess. Jesus Christ. That ain't gave the cook extra motherfucking. He caught me fast as shit. The cook was not that fast before. See, and then you gotta account for that. Um, a lot of the family members are running scout, so they're much faster. I did the Goofy too. I went over there with the Connie and I made all that noise and shit. But I made it up to her because I got all the motherfuckers off of her. I was trying to, I put the powder down so if they came over there, they'd be blinded. But it, that, that chicken was over there. That nugget. Damn, oh well. That's why when you get over there, you're trying to lock the door, you need to... I should have had a, a bone scrap and knocked the, uh, hit the nugget and knocked them out. That way it wouldn't have been ma making no noise no more. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Hopefully it don't take too long to find a game this time. I'm surprised all the friendly members stayed last time. The cook was fast as shit, and I'm like, damn, how is he this fast? They they definitely had to do something with Scout, man. That's like the hitchhiker. He's even faster. Like, how is the cook that damn fast? I barely run Scout now, because I, I gotta, you know, you trying to find other combinations of perks. 
You're not gonna be able to run scout the whole time, so. I just think if, if I mean, you could run scout if you're a family member. Don't get me wrong, but I think you really test your skills out if you don't run scout. Because if you run scout, you get an extra boost of speed. But do that without, do try to do the same stuff without scout. It's gonna be much harder. But everybody wants easy. That's why a lot of these family members quit in the first fucking place. Because they want fucking easy. Look, somebody else just left. A fucking family member, of course. I don't see too many victims leaving. Yeah, they leave. Don't get me wrong. But majority of the time, it's the family members that's leaving. And these two are in a party, so I, I doubt if they're going to leave. If they leave, both of them going to leave. Looks like they're in a party. They, I might, they might not be, though. Yeah, it's like the family member, I mean, the, the, the victims, they don't want to go through them long wait times, so they'll just sit and wait. The family, once they leave, they get into a match right away. So it's like really no penalty for them. On top of them not, not having a lobby penalty, they, it's not like, it's no risk to them. It's no risk at all. But it does get annoying when you got constantly got family members quitting.
Yeah, the freaking victims, they don't want to back out because they don't want to wait for another freaking five minutes. Actually, you know what? Yeah, the cook did catch up to me real freaking fast. So, like, Virginia should be able to outrun him. For real. If they're not going to tune, if they're not going to put Scout down, like, tone, tone it down, they need to make choose flight back to where it was three charges. How it was before they did that update because they but they need to tune well i mean i guess the family should be overpowered though they should they should but damn the cook catching up to people like that like that's crazy i ran off on his ass i'm like all right i'm good i'm gonna get away and the, the fucking cook was on my ass the sissy was too I expect the sissy to be a little faster than the cook, but I don't expect the cook to be that fast. Like, that was super fucking fast. He caught up to me and then the sissy hit me and killed me, but it's like, damn, how did he catch me that fast? Probably he might have his stamina all the way up, plus he got his stamina's all the way up, plus he got scout. And then he probably got fired up. Well, maybe he got serrated too. Like I said, at some point, like I, 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 I was running scout and all that shit too, but gun media keeps saying like, yeah, we looking at the perks that's being used the most. Uh, I guess y'all, uh, I don't know. Cause you already know that the majority of the people that play family are running scout. They want to be faster. It makes it easier to catch victims. If they're not running anything else, now you got some family members that'll run like with with uh, Leatherface. They'll run like the uh, what is it called? I forget the one where it's it's pretty much like serrated, but it's called something else. I think it's slow. Is it slow cut? Whatever. I run it on my Leatherface, but that a lot of them run that big swings and his uh, hysterical strength, or they run violent and hysterical strength or they run big swings violent a lot of times people don't want to run violent because they don't want to collect no blood they're not feeding grandpa at all anyway so they don't really care about collected blood I swear, when I be playing against family members, they be all coordinating and shit. Oh, hold on. Yep, I got her new dress on. I got her new dress. Yeah, they be all coordinated and shit, and then I be playing with people that not coordinated, don't, don't care to talk on the mic and all that. It's crazy.
personal belongings linked to a missing but i just gotta you gotta get to it you gotta assume that every game you going in by yourself you gotta assume that overnight while on a trip through texas hill country more than six months ago the couple's vehicle was reportedly recovered near cypress mill last november but no further evidence has been on earth until now police say a wallet and pocketbook containing ids matching the husband and wife were found scattered near the pedernales river the couple's whereabouts are still unknown a series of home invasions throughout bell county have turned into a search for a known fugitive omar Pauly, native of holland texas was arrested in 1967 for aggravated assault and larceny and was sentenced to five years in prison after his release Omar Pauly was implicated in a string of incidents outside what the hell? county where he was arrested again but managed to escape authorities. His current whereabouts are unknown. Another disturbance was reported at the event. There we go. Outside of Hills Prairie, deputies responded to a caller reporting loud noises from the dilapidated facility after midnight. Police investigated the site and found evidence of trespassing and minor equipment theft, but suspect it is merely the work of local now all I'm doing is creating distractions. All I'm doing with Anna is creating distractions. Is it a leather face? Yep. Anna got this church dress on. Oh shit, there's no bone scrap right there. Oh shit, they're showing the draws too? Damn. They got in all of her draws. What the hell? Now they finna come down here. Which door did she open? Johnny's a tryhard, so he he's. You get away from me. Damn! What door does she open? Must be this one over here. Wait, what's that? Oh shit! I'm going the wrong way. Yep, this one right here. Come on, come on, come on. Be careful. Did she go to the back? What the hell?
Hey, what's going on, no nine? Oh shit, she out. I'm gonna stab her motherfucking ass. Get your ass out of here. See you later. GG. GG. Nobody got time for that bullshit. Oh, this the last one left. Leland better get his ass outside. I don't know what the hell is Leland doing. They about to turn the battery on. Go right to the battery. She's sitting in the back, bro. All you gotta do is knock her over. I guess they wasn't in the party. I don't know what the hell is Leland doing. I'm not finna sit here and watch this. That's ridiculous. I have no clue what he's doing. I was able to escape with Anna and with her new dress on. I like that new dress though. They showed her little drawers. I'm like, what the hell? I'm looking at them like, damn, that shit is like Nancy. <laughs> like Nancy's, uh, I don't know what the hell, man. That was a good design though. I like it. I like using the darker, darker color clothes. The lighter color clothes, you, they could see you from a mile away with those on. Especially at night, they can't really see you. During the daytime, they can see you much more, even with darker color clothes on. That was good though, Virginia. The Virginia, she uh, 
she got to the battery side. So it wasn't open when I went over there at first, but she she was able to she had fast hands on, so she was able to get that shit open. Virginia came in clutch again. This is crazy how long it's taking to find a victim match. Crazy. Even with streaming, you gotta edit a lot of this stuff out, but I'm gonna put timestamps on it so people don't have to just sit and, and look into the lobby simulator. I, I start putting timestamps on my streams, that way people could skip to different stuff, so. People like to skip around on YouTube videos anyway. I'm, I'm guilty of that too. I do the same thing. It's like, get to the point. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, I'm, not, I'm try, not trying to sit here for 30 minutes and you ain't got to the point yet. I made it, I had a video out the other day. It was on Killer Clowns from Outer Space. And it, somebody commented like, uh, one of my viewers commented like, yeah, I appreciate you just playing the video and not talking a whole bunch. So I was like, I don't, I just like to get to the point. Most people, when they come to streams and, and videos and stuff, more so videos, obviously streams is gonna be longer and drawn out. But videos, they want you to just get to the point. They don't want you to just, They don't want you to keep talking the whole time. It's like, just get to the point of the video. You know what I mean? They want you to get right to the point, and that's what I... This might work. What is that? Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, she came literally right here. the fuck man trying to trying to be nice and shit because when i locked the fucking door people bitch and whine about me not uh, why'd you lock the door he came literally right there jesus christ you know from now on i'm locking the fucking door all right i appreciate y'all watching i'm gonna head out Check out my next videos, my next live streams, all that. Subscribe to the channel. See you on the next stream.